hi you guys welcome back to my channel basically bali and for everyone who's just new to the channel welcome again my name is bali and for all my friends who've been here um thanks for clicking another video and yeah uh just to kind of shed some light on what we do on this channel we do things to makeup most recently mostly fashion and uh yeah we just talk things girly fashion hair you know um, so again, welcome. Thanks for clicking yet another video. And in today's video, I'm actually really excited. Like, oh my goodness. In today's video, I'm going to um, give you my first impression of my new buy, which I have sitting here. And oh my God, can you hear it? Okay, this is a new uh, bag that I just recently purchased and I wanted to do my first impression. Um, I have unboxed it, but again, it's still kind of brand new. This is going to be my first, well, my second look at it. So, um, yeah, I wanted to do a quick video to actually do my first impression. So this is not going to be a review, um, maybe like after I've had a, a chance to wear it or carry it a few times, but, um, I feel like this is going to be, um, good to actually record my impression about it and then maybe along the way at some point Maybe I can do another video and let you know my thoughts on um, This particular bag. So anyway without further ado, we'll jump right in. This is the I don't know if anyone can tell but Yeah, it is the Bottega Veneta or Veneta Bottega Veneta um, Cassette chain, I think it's cassette chain or maybe chain cassette um but yeah, the Bottega Veneta chain cassette bag. So the bag just arrived today and here I am. That's why I'm super excited. So the bag literally came in a shipping box and in the box, the actual duffel bag was wrapped in the plastic bag. But this is how the bag came. It's just a duffel bag, no box. Um, and in it is this beautiful, and I'm sure folks probably know and in it is this beautiful, oh my God, oh my God. Okay, all right. I will share details on how I got here with this bag. Anyway, so I've always been a Bottega fan and this bag is quite loud. Um, I feel like, yeah, this is, this is a lot. Um, when I was actually re reading the reviews on this bag before I actually made the purchase, um, a lot of people did say this is not the kind of bag that you carry when you want to sneak up on someone. As you all can tell, it is quite loud. Um, but, oh, this bag is absolutely beautiful. So how did I get here? Anyway, I've always been a Bottega Veneta. Veneta? Veneta? However you say it. I've always been a fan of Bottega Veneta styles, particularly the shoes. Anyone who's watched my previous videos, you guys know how I obsessively love the little slippers. And so I've kind of been on Bottega for a minute now, and this bag, quite honestly, was not really on my radar. I mean, I've seen it. I know it's been out for maybe two seasons. Um, but again, it wasn't something that I was checking for or even thought I'd get. Um, however, recently, I'm gonna insert a, a picture. I saw um, I, her Instagram handle is Lolo Wood. If you guys know her, she's Odell Beckham's girlfriend. Um, yeah, there was this picture of her I saw where she was carrying this bag and I was like, hold on, wait a minute, what? Like, I always saw the bag, but it just never really spoke to me until I saw her carrying it. Perhaps maybe it's how she started, how she wore it, how she carried it. I was like, oh, bag i think i want one um so that's kind of when i started thinking okay it's a cute bag i'll see you know if i can figure out a way to get me one but like again these bags similar to every bottega style they come in different oh, this noise is gonna drive me crazy i'm gonna put it down for a while um they come in different colors uh but i think out of all the colors that come in, which I'll probably, uh, I'll, I'll insert a link to the actual Bottega um, site where you guys can see all the different colors that it comes in. Of all the different colors, I like the black one, the white one, and this one. Like, I feel like Bottega has a signature green, which is more like that, you know, 
I don't know what shade green it is, but it's not this um, deep shade. It's more like a light green, and that color just doesn't really like speak to me. But this particular color I thought was super cute. And this one is uh, actually, it's called Rainforest. I'm gonna look at the tag if I can find it. It's called Rain Tree Gold. That's this color, it's Rain Tree Gold. Oh my goodness. I just see here and this is something I am going to speak to here this is clearly an old tag because here it has four thousand one hundred dollars on the tag but um, all the designers have recently done a price increase on pretty much everything so now this bag retails for fifty five hundred but when the bag initially launched it was retailing for four thousand one hundred dollars so as you can see it's been scratched out uh yeah this makes me feel some kind of ways but um yeah so anyway we'll get to that in a, in a bit so anyway i saw lola wood carrying the bag and out of nowhere i had this strong desire for this bag and i started tracking it and eventually i was able to get my hands on it this was purchased from Sat. And as I mentioned, this bag retails for $5,500 now. Initially, it used to retail for $4,100. Um, so anyway, I felt like I needed to have this bag because it's different from anything else that I've ever owned in terms of bags. And I just feel like this bag is a statement. Um, I'll carry it here so you guys can really see what, it, like how I, how you could carry it. I know I've done, again, I've done some research and I've seen people carrying it like crossbody or what they call the top handle and then just let the long chain hang or again you can carry it kind of double on the chain either ways I think this bag is a stunner and I particularly like this color which again it's called this color is the rain tree gold but as I mentioned they come in several several different colors and uh, you can look on the Bottega website and see all the different colors that this bag comes in now let's see in terms of sizing i feel like this bag is a pretty good size again this ball kitchen makes it feel even larger than life but in practicality it actually is a pretty good size bag and in opening it it's obviously leather um and bottega has a signature woven style like a lot of their styles a lot of their handbags have this woven look and to open it it's it's kind of like a clasp that you pull and open and inside it again it's just obviously paper stuffed in but in it you can see there's a zipper in a zipper pocket what's in it okay just look. um i feel like this bag i've seen people do some comparison online and you can compare this it's actually bigger than like an ipad mini it's a bit bigger than uh, the size of an ipad mini so inside again, it's a pretty good size bag that you can fit just about anything. Your phone, your keys. I feel like your typical day-to-day -day, um, bag, you could fit just as much in this bag. And the leather is just the, the detail and it feels padded. I feel like there's some padding to it. Um, as far as like, I think practicality, I think it's very practical. However, I still question where you would carry this bag to. I feel like, okay, yes, if you had an event, you were going out, maybe brunch. I feel like it might be too much. It depends on the brunch anyway. Um, and you could have it like night out, date night. Oh, yes. And in terms of weight, if you guys can't tell by the way I'm holding it, it is quite heavy. I feel like it's mostly the chain that gives it a good weight. Um, again, it's not a, I, I, for me, the chain doesn't bother me, but I don't know, it might bother someone if you're not a fan of like rattling, clicking sounds, but I feel like it's all part of the effect for me. Um, what's to be said about this bag? I feel like, again, this bag has um, gone up in terms of how much it costs, but that's again, across the board, all designers are starting to increase prices on everything. I mean, literally things that you bought over the summer has actually gone up um, in price. So if this is something that you've had on you know, your radar, you may wanna look into getting it now because I still feel like the prices keeps trending up and you may eventually even pay more for this bag in the near future. So um, yeah. So, I mean, 
what is my first impression on the bag? I feel like it's a wow. It's a wow statement. Um, it's a very bold bag. Um, it's not something you want to just... I mean, if you carry this bag, I think people are going to notice that you have... You're carrying a bag, right? It's not something that you just day-to-day -day kind of carry and just get by. I feel like this is a statement bag. And I think that's really what Bottega would have been going for. Um, creating a, a design like this. I mean, it is quite a statement piece. So... Um, I'm going to do another video in the very near future, let you guys know my impression or my experience carrying this bag, how I carried it, where I carried it to, but I just wanted to do a quick video, first impression, opening the bag, do I feel like it's worth the money? Quite honestly, I feel like it's a very expensive bag as of like the current price. I think at $4,000, it's, it's worth $4,000, but I don't know if I would say, um, at five thousand five hundred dollars yeah um i still love it i'm glad i was able to uh, purchase this bag but um i feel like if the trend continues then this price may just be way overpriced for the value so um again stay tuned guys i will do another video where i talk about my experience um owning this bag and what how i wore it where i wore it to um, and just my overall thought on whether you know you should consider adding this to your shopping cart or your wish list or if you can totally skip this bag. Um, the only thing I can say is there's nothing like this um, on the market. I don't think I've seen a bag. Um, and I think all Bottega bags are very distinctive in the look and the style of it that everyone, I mean, if you, hold, if you were to carry this bag, people know it's that signature Bottega bag. So. Thank you so much for watching and stay tuned to see how I carry this bag just to show you guys how you can wear it either crossbody or top handle and uh, yeah, bye you guys. Okay, you guys, so um, as I've already mentioned in the video, this bag does retail at $5,500 US dollars. Uh, when Bottega initially launched this bag, I think about a year or two ago, it was priced at $4,100. That is a 34% price markup. But as I mentioned, a lot of these designers are increasing prices all across the board. 34% um, price markup seems to be excessive, and at this at this current uh, 5500 tag, I think this bag is overpriced, but nonetheless, still a very beautiful bag. So.